love is in the air and so is Oscar season. What's up everyone? I'm Ashley Bornanson with the Red Carp Report and today we're kicking back at Fig and Olive at Doris Bergman's Oscar Valentine Lounge where celebs are getting the sweetest swag for their Valentines. We will. Just leave it right there for one second. Are you guys friends? Oh no. my god. We're, we're married. We just met yeah. on Christian Mingle. But, um, <laughs> Yeah, no, we we, we actually time. had planned for a long time to just go ahead and, and live together yeah. and start a community called Uterville for divorced, bitter, single moms. Right. And, what, uh, was your, what, was the, what was the billboard again? Uh, Welcome to Uterville. No, no, it was uh, it was like giving up. It was this. Oh, why yeah, not? Oh, why yeah, not? this was it. No, might as well. This might was, as well. This was our catchphrase. Might as well. That was it. Yeah, that's it. You guys are crazy. I but don't know what to found, believe. Now she found a she man. Sadly, she found a man. Wait, wait, sadly she doesn't believe that can this I, is not a true story. Can I brag about you? No. I, I seriously adore her. And I would, she makes me laugh every single day. And I'm just only a little pissed off that after literally one night on Match.com. I think it was two. One night on Match.com. Oh, you yanked your picture after one night. Yes. One yes. night and five. You it. really Thank were you. on Match.com. Yeah. Oh, Excuse yeah, me. 5,000 hits. In one night, she yanks her picture. She was like this. She was like this. Let me see what's out there. 5,000 hits. Yank. And then she yanked it. And then she contacted two guys, two, and one of them, she went, I will choose you. You may marry me. And then she ran with this. Ran. She ran. And I ran. Wait, she you ran. met your husband on Mesh.com? I totally did. I told my fiance, yes. I did. And then she put me on match. I did. And then I wrote so my help. normal, hot-looking people are on Mesh. Are you kidding? I know so many people who are either getting married or, or married from it. It's ridiculous. Really? Yes. What am I going to do? Like, meet an actor on my show? I mean, an I was going to say, is that why? <laughs> yes. Is that why? Yes, I'm no, not going to. If, meet scummy I think, people if, if you're no, a 40 year old going to a bar, I think that's a problem. And I don't date not actors, just 40. so that's a they're problem. They're 50 and they've never been married and they don't have kids. And they're like, I'm not sure if I want one. And I'm like, are you Warren Beatty? You should really have figured that out by now. It's because Los Angeles is the land where prom queens go to die. And the bell curve's all fucked up. You're going to have to bleep that. That's why. See, girls. No, I'm loving this. Just keep going. No, this is all. This is why LA from, is the genius. Is the most horrific place for accomplished, smart, fun women with good souls. All the good. You can't meet a guy because every prom queen in America gets on a bus, comes out here, mm -hmm. and they want to be actresses, and like one makes it. And so you lie about your age on Match.com. Well, she lied about my age. And I lie about everyone's age. Men lie about their height. Women lie about their age. Oh, and, the, and, and then on the first the date, ball. you and tell the them the what? They wear hats in their pictures. Yeah. Well. And then it's like this. Whoops! Hi, surprise. That's how. Okay, yeah. But what in? Like, but are you scared your, to go no, on something on Match.com when you're kind of known? And, you know. No, because that's why I took my thing down. I mean, the thing is. To quote uh, Lou Ferrigno, no, I'm not quoting Lou Ferrigno, I just saw him, so I wanted to say. Okay, um, but you should, whenever possible. When, I, whenever, when in doubt, I quote Lou Ferrigno um, in my daily life. But, but uh, I feel like I want to go get a drink with these ladies. Yeah. That's about how everybody feels. <laughs> and we're sober. Yeah, but you know what? The good news is, in about two years, when she's 18, she'll be running Hollywood, so... I know. So between her and the Parent Trap fans, you're I want to be my friend. That's true. I should be employed. That's very exciting. Any minute now. Any that's she'll just give us her own show when she's the head of uh, whatever network that we haven't heard of yet, but will be a new network. And our show will be called this. Might as well. I love this. Yeah. I feel like I'm being complimented. Maybe I don't know. You totally oh, yeah. are. You totally are. We're on Hollywood. We wouldn't talk shit in front of your face. Just behind your no, back. Just behind my back. On Match.com. No. Exactly. Dude, that's inspiring. I know. Oh, guys also take pictures of their motorcycles. Not yeah. them even with their motorcycles, just and like cars. their toys. And cars. I've decided that Match.com is men actually think that they're dating men on that site. Because they put like all pictures of them like on any board they can find, a snowboard, a surfboard, a paddleboard, and like doing all the guy stuff they love to do and their motorcycle. Like they're Basi trying to attract men. Yeah, it's basically like this. Here's all the shit my wife wouldn't let me do when we were married. And if you have a problem with it, I don't want to be with you either. I'm going to be doing this. If you want to get on one of these boards or my motorcycle, all right. Are you still on it or have you found a lucky I someone? don't even really do it. I like I like I okay. like shop and then she did you change one of my settings the other no. day when you went no because all of a sudden she's like, still on it go ahead and find her people. go up go find Lisa I've got like or a maybe thousand, it's a pseudo name no that's my name but I don't tell people but I have a thousand children that's part of the problem oh wow yeah. I'm older 
I'm not as thin, and I live in oh a shoe. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? Look how hot you look. It's just little in the I middle. I was like, I need to do whatever she's doing. Seriously, what you I guys both are super fit. Match. What do you guys do to stay well, in shape? When I was in my 20s, I would answer that question thinking it was funny on the red carpet, saying like bulimia or you know something horrific. I've since been reprimanded that it's not funny and it's not true. Um, yes, uh, what do I do? You eat, you eat, in, you eat in moderation. I started working out when I was 38 and a half and I, because I found out I had to. And uh, whatever, you just eat in moderation. Don't be How like about uh, me looking like 18. You look like 20. Yep. Well, thanks to the makers of botulism toxin A, I pioneered uh, that movement or lack thereof. Yeah. What? Yeah. Okay, we I would do a running man, but a boob would fly out and hit you in the face. We don't believe in, but the good news is, the good news is it's just plastic. It doesn't hurt that uh, much. It's not plastic, a-hole, it's saline. I'm sorry. How about you, miss? I'm hot. I, I, I'm not healthy at all. I starve myself after Christmas cookies. And then, I, and then I faint, and then she makes me go on a hike where I want to punch her in the face. We're gonna go get free stuff now. How many, wait, how many dates are you having for Valentine's tomorrow? She has one with the guy who bought her the three carat diamond. I mean, that's a pretty. And, and I have two with my 13 year old twin boys. Aww. And match.com. Hashtag. I love it. Hashtag. I love you guys. Hashtag. Congratulations on all your success. Thanks. Thanks for watching the Red Carpet Report, guys. We hope you had a great Valentine's. Let us know who's on your Oscar list this year. Like the video, subscribe, and we'll see you later.